Going on holiday can sometimes leave us getting back, feeling like we need another break. It's not always easy. But Kent International Airport is striving to make travelling as straightforward as possible. And with the check-in desk just a short stroll from the car park, the start's a promising one. Kennett's airport has seen turbulent times in its 90 years history. The recent credit crunch has left some holidaymakers questioning their travel plans. So is the future bright for Manston? I think the, uh, the company that owns the airport now being Infratil, I mean we're, we're experienced in the operation of airports around the world and I think we, uh, we know what needs to be done here and we're just working away progressively getting it done to make it be a, a successful airport in the long term. So we've got our flights from uh, Kent Escapes Travel and Newmarket Travel and uh, Channel Islands Travel, so op operating flights to places as far away as Croatia and Italy and uh, the usual Palma flights again, Las Palmas and the Canaries and also uh, Jersey flights as well this year, so it's going to be an exciting summer at Kent. It's an exciting time to be a part of an airport that's growing the way this one is. As it is at any airport, the security is paramount, including changing baggage restrictions, which still leaves some passengers confused. Check-in supervisor at Manston is Alida Cotton. Um, basically, you are allowed to take uh, two pieces of hand luggage through this airport, obviously not enormous sizes. Uh, normal size restrictions um, are in force. And as regards what you can and can't take inside the hand luggage, restricted items would be, as usual, the sharp objects, basically scissors, tweezers, nail files, anything along those lines, pen knives obviously, and uh, any lighters or matches. You are allowed to take one non-petrol lighter on your person, but matches and other lighters are not allowed either on your person or in your hold baggage. Some people are confused about that. And also, uh, when you're talking about your liquids, basically any liquids, toiletries, which would include any form of toiletries, cosmetics, makeups, that's any gels, creams, potions, perfumes and liquids. Um, they must be in 100 millilitre um, little pots or bottles or less. If they're anything over that, they're not allowed on board the aircraft in your hand luggage. Um, if they are under that, then they can be taken in the little plastic uh, see-through bags, which we do have a supply of here as well. Medication as well, there are restrictions. Tablet form of medication is normally okay. Um, most medication should be accompanied by some sort of doctor's note or a prescription. Um, if it's in uh, liquid form or inhalers, they will also be required to put in the little uh, plastic security bags as well. Regular flights to destinations including Madeira, Croatia, Mallorca and Jersey has seen the popularity of this local departure lounge increase. But what makes people choose KIA? Yeah, we've flown from Manston before um, previously and it's, it's been great. You know, your baggage comes off quickly, your baggage goes through quickly. It's, it's lovely. Ten minutes down the road, couldn't ask for more. It worked out actually cheaper to fly from Manston than it does to go from Gatwick. It's nice and local for us, so, I mean, it's sort of a 20-minute drive and the parking's right out the front, so no, it's fine. And I think the facilities are very good, the toilets are very clean. And that's very important. On a busy day like today at Kent International Airport, this aircraft will have landed, 180 passengers got off, and the turnaround of just 40 minutes, another 180 with their baggage, will be jetting off to Palma in Mallorca. It's been chartered by Kent Escapes, and this Airbus A320 will literally be refuelled, refooded, and repassengered, and be heading off to the sunny skies of Spain. With one seat left on this flight to Mallorca, it'd be foolish not to head on board. I'll see you back in a week or so, maybe. Julie Maddox, reporting for Your Kent TV, from Kent International Airport.